while everyone's running to and fro and getting things done. Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome to another episode of Oxygen Not Included. And up here, there is no oxygen included, that's for sure. I'm going to pause, because there's lots to talk about before I get rolling, and there's things that they're going to be doing over there that I don't want them to do yet. We left last time pretty much working on this area. I was thinking about running right up through here and getting into this hot water above the base and pumping it down so we can convert it into oxygen and hydrogen. The only problem is, a couple episodes back when we popped a little area of chlorine right here, it exploded into this whole space. A little bit of, of 1,000 grams per square blew into a 50 gram per square void, essentially, and just filled everything up. That's a thousand grams per square too, per, you know, that square right there. Meaning, there's so much more volume here of stuff that we don't want in our base than there was in this little area that was under the, uh, um, I want to say there was this algae that had come, you know, kind of gone through this whole area here. We dug everything out but a tiny little uh, barrier holding back the chlorine. This is going to explode and fill up everything in here. There's going to be no containing that. Every time we open a door, another whole pocketful is going to go in because there's so much more pressure in here than there is out here. Well, I guess we have caught up quite a bit, but I still, I'm, I'm just from experience, I know what's going to happen when I pop this thing. So I didn't want to run this ladder on up. We were heading for here. Or right, right there, I think it was. I didn't want to run this ladder up and pop that and try to build this while all of this just blew in through here and out it went. Yeah, it just It's just going to go bad. So, come up with another plan to get here. We still want this water. We could come up over here. I was going up here with the thought that I was going to jump in and... In fact, I can cancel a lot of this. Um, I was going to go in and let this guy loose his more by punching it through over here and let him... Just have a, have a ball turning all this chlorine into polluted oxygen. That's one of the things that they do. In fact, let me hit some cancels here so we can kind of see what's going on. Um, we're not going to do that. Why didn't that work? Okay, game. Thank you. Um, don't want to do that. Don't want to do any of that. Yeah, all this plan is gone. I was going to hollow this whole area out. Now, I'm going to be thankful just to get that out. Come up here, drop down in, punch this out, let him drop in, maybe take some of these out. So, eventually, some more of this, but none of this is leaving for now. Yeah, so that all cleans up. So, a pathway that comes up here and run across into the cold area, from the cold area into the hot area. Well, that'll get them sick. And uh, pump out of here, drop it down on the end of this area. We'll talk about what's going on here in a moment. But um, so I've been mapping this out. I've let the game run for a while. I think we were at 115 last time. So about 10 days worth of, of running time mapping this out while they're busy doing their, their stuff over on the other side. And, and what else did I do? I kind of worked through... I think this is where we ended last time. Work through the, the idea of a trap here so that any hydrogen that gets into the pathway out will vent upward into this void. Any chlorine that is in this trap will vent downward and drop into here. Eventually bust all this loose and let this morb and any others that we find up wherever to uh, just work on the chlorine down in here and convert it into something that we can convert into oxygen. So that's kind of this area. We'll get into the machinery here in a moment. But I also, you know, there's so many things that got to happen at once. Hydrogen, at least prior to this update, had not been very dependable. It, the even though the oxidizer says it makes 100 grams per second and or 112 and the hydrogen generator says it uses 100 grams per second you'd think it's one for one but it just never seems to find enough hydrogen to pump through to, to run these guys i went ahead and put in two for two just in case this update kind of fixed all of that 
But usually what happens is you've got to run this guy for a long time to build up enough hydrogen to really compact into here to then get it down and used up into here. Um, so I don't really want to depend on this. What I want to do is run natural gas. That was the big part of this update. So, and also until we can do anything, I was going to also think about running coal down in here and maybe set up the CO2 scrubber. Is that in this one? The air scrubber, which will clean out all the carbon dioxide, but it takes a lot of water. Water goes in and comes back out as polluted water. So we, in order to pull all the carbon dioxide out of here that the coal generator is going to make, it's going to make, uh, oh, only 20 grams a second. I thought it would be more than that. This guy, the scrubber, takes out what? Takes out three 300 grams per second. And what did I say on the other one? That was per second, right? Yeah, 20 grams per second. Hmm. So it would, we could run a couple of them. And one carbon dioxide scrubber could clean that all up easily. But still, we've got to... Uh, unless we ran, the, ran it just only when it's necessary. Turn it on and off. That way, we don't, way we don't go through the water too quickly. That may still be a possibility than a temporary... Uh, patch because I'm having to find more and more um, algae to keep these guys going to keep oxygen going in our base until we get power going and we can run <laughs> these guys to make oxygen go into the base so I headed down below to get to this algae over here never got there Came up with other thoughts, other ideas. Need to kind of seal this guy off. Need to tap this guy. And and the thought was we can take water from here. Kind of dump it in. Oh, well, this wall is temporary. We'll knock it down as we figure out what level this is going to going to ride at. And take that water up and weave it back and forth a couple of times and dump them into here so that we can use this water for other things. There's, there's so many steps to... In order to do one thing, you got to do three others first. In order to do those three, you got to do four others first, and it just keeps going. So I went off looking for uh, a couple of things. One, lots of algae, and also a way to get rid of all of these uh, ponds of polluted liquid by sending them further down so that we can maybe do something in this area. Um, we're having lots of trouble up in in here right now so if we wanted to move that operation into another dirty zone or what have you while I'm at it I can be getting slime and, and algae and you know it's nothing's gonna go to waste here and I discovered another steam geyser of course we already have this other steam geyser and we're fighting this steam geyser and in my search for natural gas Everywhere that we have been, looking for more heat, I still have not found another guy or a geyser of natural gas. It's just there's another steam geyser. It's gone. We've got the steam geyser that's there, and it seems like there's even one more down here somewhere. There's still no natural gas. So I've I've rolled a. Uh, I rolled snake eyes on the uh, on the ability to run a natural gas generator, which is basically like clean power. I mean, it seems like uh, what were the byproducts of that one? Natural gas lets off polluted water and some carbon dioxide. Actually, a little more than the coal. I didn't realize that. 82 grams coal lets off 20. Really. Okay, but it lets out enough power that we'd easily be able to run the uh, the air scrubber to clean it up. Um, let's off some heat. Yeah, but I really wanted to run this guy because coal runs out quite fast. You've really got to have your, your hatches working double duty to make all the coal. In fact, I kind of set up a, the beginnings of a new hatch area down in here, just kind of laid it out. There's so many projects laid out, but I'd like to be recording when I'm doing them so you guys can see it too. So we came down here, thought that we'd set up some way to tap this water, but need to get a triple wall in here to seal that up. I got to thinking, I don't really need this triple wall in if we just make sure not to touch this thing. That should continue to hold back the water just fine. So as long as I don't break into this, I should be okay. But over here, 
And over here. Huh. I wonder if I should take this up a little bit. Problem is, if I get up too high, we're going to... You know, the water may not be produced fast enough out of this geyser to fill up this basin unless I'm down lower with the basin. I don't know. i got to rethink this. We've only just begun to dig. In fact, let's cancel the dig so I've got time to, to think about exactly how I want to do this. That's the weak spot right there. Um, yeah, we'll think about that one yet. But while doing all of this, while punching out this, the carbon dioxide is dropping into this area. In fact, I've turned a lot of these off, I believe. Um, no, he's running. Let me run the game a second. Yeah, he's up and running. This guy is a lower priority. Let me just take you down to like a six. Yeah. So none of these have got uh, um, have got anything running in them. We'll take you to a six also because the carbon dioxide has dropped down quite a bit. So we're doing fine there. Um, up in here, yeah, we're fine over here too. So let's take you down to a six as well. I'm not going to run you. You also six. Been no need for it. We'll tear some of these out as we finally start getting control of things. I don't think this was in last time. I don't think it was. I, I took out... What was here? This floor was... No, that was up there. I don't remember now. A lot happens in 10 days, 10 cycles. But we were having a food problem last time. Not quite a crisis, but building up toward one. So I threw in some more of these guys and ran the plumbing both directions so that uh, we can we can feed two groups of them out of this shut down the uh, the filter down here run you know, cleaning up water and dropping it down below because there just isn't enough polluted water out of these two devices to run all of this and that so this may eventually go away completely but I'll, I'll leave it there just in case there's another reason later to do something with it we may eventually run polluted water on up and into this and drip down. Who knows? If we do, we'll have to move this over, though. It's going to drip the wrong way. But while all of that was going, and I had the game just running on slow and, you know, thinking my way through stuff and working on this and that, trying to get to where I could turn, I can hit record again and we can start building. Though I'm real hesitant to build in here. I'll tell you why in a bit. But then I got to looking over here and you know they we ran this one up here for them to get up and get more of the algae and and what have you and i ran down into here because there were a couple of patches of algae right in this lower area here i thought there was enough here to withstand i thought there were three tiles deep of slime and algae to hold back this pond apparently i was wrong by one of them and it started to crack and drip through, and it broke through. That's why I added the, the ladder here so that they would you know, catch, I think it was this layer right here, and maybe one spot right there. I guess that spot also. And But this, I thought, was f full too? I don't know. They're all marked with a dig, but I only hit nines on a couple of them. Otherwise, they're all fives. So I thought I had planned that out, but apparently I missed something. So the water came down into here. And what I didn't expect them to do was to be able to get down into here. We blocked this off. And unfortunately, the water level's up to the door now and it's starting to leak through. But we blocked this off, and I didn't count on them being able to jump from here down to there. In fact, we're going to demonstrate it. We are. There it is. That's how they, It's like watching your, your home video you know, surveillance camera of how the puppy gets out of the box and works its way through and around and yeah they just they just demonstrated it but in the process of getting down here things that i had marked before that i wasn't worried about happening because they were busy because they didn't have access down here now they do and they kind of tunneled through and popped us so we're now part of the steam geyser I was going to build up a triple wall in here before we ever broke through this. But apparently they did something to one or two of them. The rest of it broke through. There's the evidence down there. And we're now free. Free, uh, clean, very hot water 
blasting into this area along with our natural gas from that guy and it's a mess so we're going to have to hold back some water here so i need to get more of the i'm using insulated let me look at the difference here insulated says use as floor and wall tile to build rooms reduces heat transfer between walls use regular tiles floor and wall tiles to build rooms same description the only difference is this line right here reduces heat transfer and that it's purple <laughs> what does this say duplicates find these tiles easier on their feetsies than jagged bedrock that's why they, they run faster on it so they should have the same strength just depends on what you make it out of so you know granite is what's typically what you know what i would typically use for holding back pressure but what i did just before i hit record is told them to get in here and build this layer and as soon as they build this layer then i want to quickly build a second layer over that before this breaks and we should see cracking through it and, and uh, you know, have that, that give in. If we can get that layer on there next, I guess I could lay these out, right? Um, insulated, I don't know that I really need more than one. Maybe we'll go with regular granite for the next layer. We'll make that a priority five so they can work on the priority nines first. That should work. Once that's in, we'll bust up the ladders quickly, do another layer over the top, and kind of put a plug in this. Then we should be able to start dealing with insulating the rest of this to kind of, you know, break the, the heat transfer from this side to this side. Maybe eventually cool this area down. But that's what's up. That's why I've had it paused all this time. I wanted to get to where I could explain this before I, by the time I did all that, what have I been doing this for? 15 minutes 20 minutes they would have already built this and i wouldn't have been able to show you but let's get this built i don't think anybody oh that scared me they can climb from here to there because they can't jump up two to get to that ladder but this one is in okay <laughs> we're not gonna lose any dupes here uh-uh now nobody's gonna get built into this right you're running away Nobody's saying that they are... Okay, we, we can get out. Ebony, you're safe. You're safe. Okay, so we're built here. Temperature 113. Um, that is granite. Yeah. So we'll see how this goes. Dare I put a second one in now? Well, let's just kind of monitor this. Hot. Hot. Toasty surroundings, sopping wet, holding breath, and Ebony just hit 20, and Handy just hit 20, and Alexander just hit 20. Uh, 20 is the trigger point to go get a massage. How's our research? Let me think here. Where are we at? Wow. One last little um, novice research, and we're done with research. That gets us the the power transformer and the heavy watt wire, which, back down here to research, brought Nettie to a 1, Alexander to a 2, and Jafar is already a 2, Ickes, or a 3, and Ickes is a 3. So that ends the research too, which means this goes away, no more power usage out of those, and no more uh, uh, taking our time for, for research. Good. So do we have tables up and running? You guys are 9s, you're 20 to 15, 9. I want these guys always set to 9, no matter what, we're going to relieve stress. And that's where these three just all ran off to go to. So you are heading down to do what? You are picking up sandstone to build ladders. Okay, good. Too bad we can't get you just above the oxygen level there to be able to breathe. So your timer is going to keep going down and going down. But... Ooh, that's already damaging. It's already one third damaged. Wow. Interesting. There's no way they're going to get that one built and get these built before that is gone. <sighs> okay. Let's. Jafar, you just hold your breath there. Time has stopped, so you're you're fine. Um, 
Let's cancel all that one, that one, and I guess we get to rebuild that one. Let's go in with... Is there a chance that that broke so... Or is, is degrading so fast because it's insulated and not the other? I mean, I would think insulated would even resist heat damage more. Really at 110. 110, 110 degrees, 109, 113. Okay, there we are, 109, 109. I mean, I can put my hand in 110 degree water for a little while. How did that break it? What am I missing here? 4,200 grams of, shall we say, pressure versus 800. 800. 38. Maybe it's a pressure thing. 9,000 there. Interesting. That's a lot. 9,000 kilograms of water crammed into that one square. Eight hundred of the polluted and nine thousand of the water because they don't interact with each other. You either get polluted or you get water. You can't have both in the same square. So it is condensing and, and compressing all the water that wanted to flow through this whole area into just these six little squares here. That must be what's going on. And so it is creating an artificial, ridiculous amount of pressure. Unreasonable. You know, in real life, that would never be able to build up. It would automatically release down into here where it's only 2,900. But the game is sending it all up into this and is compacting it all. Wow. We may never be able to get that built. Huh. Well, I think I'm going to pull an executive decision here. And cancel this whole area. You hop out of here. This is going to fail. As long as that's saying 9,000 pounds. Um, let's do something different. It may still fail. But if I stay within the polluted water. And the... Right there. The 800 kilograms. I wonder if that will get us through better. Let's take you, and you are... Actually, do that again. Overheat temperature plus 27. Plus 27. Plus 27. We'll go with obsidian. I wonder if there's any chance that it gets stronger as it goes this way. Let's find out. You are a 9. You are insulating. I'm going to put one layer of insulating right there. And let's make sure that there's priorities. Yeah, let's five you and I did that, didn't I? Five you and you and you. All right, we can get safely out of here. Do want to get this done, but that's not as important. I don't think it's going to go diagonal quickly. Let's uh, prior let's just do it this way. You insulated tile. You're already a five. Okay. I must have started right there. Okay. So with that, let's see if we can punch this out real quick and then fill in the space right here. And then go up here a little bit and build out over this and just kind of abandon this whole corner. That might be the way to survive this. All right. You can get out of there safely. Good. Curious to see what's going to happen here. Um. All right. Murphy, what are you up to? You are picking up granite. Really? Why are you picking up granite? Seems like a waste of our time. Oh, picking up... You have granite. You were coming down to build. Have you... You're repairing. Thank you. Okay, that bought us a little time. Okay. I thought I was going to have to rebuild that one. I probably still will have to rebuild that one. I kind of didn't count on that uh, surviving. Yeah. Let's abandon this one. Deconstruct it. That's not going to... That's just going to keep going bad on us. And they're going to keep 
diverting their attention, trying to keep it repaired. Hello. <laughs> you pooped. Okay, so that's going to... Well, where are we anyway? We've still got a lot of day left. Uh, you are... Handy is going to deconstruct. Okay. You're going to deconstruct. And let's see if we can get the new ones built as fast as possible. I wonder if there's a harvest or anything going on. And you gave up already. <laughs> okay. Um, no, no harvest going on. There's lots of other jobs queued up. I didn't plan on doing this. You are deconstructing. Or are you repairing? You're repairing still. Thanks, Nettie. Okay, what else is going on? We're going to have to tone everything else down so we can make this happen. So, priority. And, yeah, there's a lot going on. All right, let's seven everything else so we can just concentrate on this. Everything that they can reach. Um, in fact, I might even abandon some of that. But let's kind of do that. Everything they can reach right now. In fact, the rest of this, let's just five it. Okay. Now, click and hold, because it takes a while t for it to recognize. There we go. Can't get to here. That's fine. Let's take all this to fives as well. All right. So nothing is reachable, and they won't... Let's five these. I want a chance to rethink about that before we commit. Alright, so what else is going on? These are all sevens and the only other nines except this one. I wanted, I need a wheeze wart. I haven't even gotten to that one yet. We'll talk about that in a moment. Uh, but I do need the other one done first. Okay, so let's seven this group so I remember to come right back to it. This will be one of our next priorities and there's that, yeah, that delay. There we go. Big delay. Alright, you're fine. Seven's in there. All these are fives. Oh, it goes so slow. we got to work on that this episode, too. Um, that's the wheeze wart. Well, I wanted to dig into that other one. So let's seven. Mine seven? Yeah. These three, just the, the remnants of, of this project. And let's seven through there. Okay. I think that was it as far as construction projects. There are still nines out there that are... Oh, there's one more there. You are now a seven. There are nines out there as far as uh, maintenance, but, you know, harvests and all that sort of stuff, and they're just as important. But that should cue everybody up for the last half of this day to just come down and work on this. And we're going in with what? Going in with obsidian. And Ebony is going to deconstruct. Good. If she can make it there long enough. Ebony is 23% stress. Why are you not de-stressing? You are now. You're relaxing. But that just fell apart. Okay. So, we want to insulate. Obsidian. Nine. There. And verify that everything... Yeah, you guys are all nines. And then, once that's queued up, we will set another layer... I won't do it yet, though, just in case the game has any weird interaction with another build blueprint right in front of it. And making it so they can't reach the other one for some strange reason. Be nice to set this, get this build, too, but I'm not going to add anything else. Let's get all the materials dropped in. Hopefully you brought more than just one. One, two, good. Ah, oh, well, there's two out of four. Do you have the other... Does it say what you're carrying? It says you're delivering. I'm curious. There's no mention of obsidian there. Details? Well, your bladder efficiency. But <laughs> um, no, I'm looking for obsidian and a number. Does not say what you are carrying. How about here? Delivering. <clears throat> really? Out of all this information here, you think it would say what you're carrying? That seems like basic information. Well, maybe uh, next round of updates. Someone will think about uh, adding that to it. I mean, you've got to admit, they've added a lot to it. 
to uh, uh, there's so much information in this game all right you've got the last of it now hopefully we can all come down here at once and build it all at one time that would be great because the the timer starts once the build is complete and before it's complete I'd love to have the next layer in and then the next one so that's the hope we may still lose this guy which means you might want to go four layers thick once this is done maybe we'll see all right so what's happening you guys are on your way. You look like you're ready to build. Yep. And who's what? Ebony, Nettie, Natalia. Why are you guys... You went up to relax. Ebony did. But you're not... You are on a table. Oh, good. You're just not going down very fast. You were at 23, now you're at 24. Hmm. What's the decor look like in here? I didn't... Yeah. I haven't gone full scale. This was a temporary fix while we're waiting for this. And even this isn't the greatest. Why is that? That's not done yet, but we're not going to put a nine there right now. Okay. Anyway, so we've got three that cannot, but we have seven that can. So let's see who's going to make the trip down here. Handy so far. And that looks like Kathra and Natalia and Murphy, right? Yeah. All heading down here to build. So this isn't what I was planning on centering this episode on today, but this seems to be the excitement of the day. Uh, watching this guy... Well, Kathra changed her mind, and she's got to go jump into a massage table. Okay. That one is built, and Murphy gave up at the last second. So close. Or was it this one? I don't know, but we'll see who comes down to run the next one as that one starts to die. Come on, guys. Get this built. Here comes Alexander. See what he can do. And if this fails, then we'll take it all back to this layer. Of... <laughs> he gave up already. All right, let's see what Nettie can do. And he's gonna dive across. We're all we got so many of them hitting that 20 mark. This might and yeah, we're already breaking. Ha ah, I can see it already. It's gonna fail. Okay. Cancelled again. The unrealistic game numbers here. Still 9600 pressure building up in here. And we're going sideways? No, that's oxygen. We're going to have to... I see, we moved over. We moved over. Ah. Or did I put it in the wrong spot? Was the water in this one and this one? Or was it in this one and this one? I don't know now. But once it's built, it displaces it. There's not supposed to be any pressure there, but there's pressure here pushing on it. Is that what's going on? Do I need to build it here? I think I do. I think I do. We're going to ignore that one. It's going to break on its own. We're going to lose these materials till we get down into here. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. All right. We're going to cancel all of you guys for now. We're not going to be looking at that anymore. We're going to build one more time. Insulated Obsidian 9. And we're going to put it clear over here. Like that. We're going to have t a buffer of two between us. And... Boy... We're going to prep for that first by getting these two built. All right, cancel you guys. You're going in as obsidian also. I'm going to build you guys. We're going to priority eight these. Let's build the base and let's rebuild the ladder so that it comes down... Let's see, this can be regular sandstone, nine. You're going to drop right here instead. Um, and one is fine. We have plenty of support down here. So I only need one layer here. It's, it's the area where I need more layers. This needs to come down so we can build a second wall as fast as possible once this one's built. So we're going to prepare for that as well. Deconstruct all. You guys take that out. 
All right. Now, Nettie, if I were to move you to here, would you recalculate what you need to do and jump into tearing these apart? You move to there, and you're going to recalculate. All right. Otherwise, you were heading to who knows where. So this part will already be done. Someone else, hopefully, is already picking up obsidian to go and... Nope. Don't build. Um, disable auto repair. Thank you. Can you work on that one? You're picking up and you're loading. Don't you dare get yourself stuck over there. Okay, well that's fine. These are eights. You can still get through. You're going to run out of air here soon. And, and Oh, no. They haven't built these yet. Did I really do that? I really did that. Okay. Emergency. Wah, wah, wah. Let's... Okay. We got to build. How do we do this? You are... What do we have around here? Slime, polluted water. I'm looking for sandstone. What is nearby? Obsidian is nearby. 200... All right, we're going to, and this is obsidian down here, right? Detail, obsidian. Okay, we have obsidian here. All right, let's use what we have. We're going to cancel these two. We have obsidian. We're going to cancel that. We're going to put in, I guess in this position, ladder, obsidian, nine. There and there. You can hop up. Okay, so we only need to build two. So, let's see what happens. And you are filling in. Alright, we're going to cancel all of you so that you're going to... Let's let's move you so that you have, you're have you forced to recalculate what you're going to do next. Move to right there. Alright. Picking it up. Filling it in. Building it. Is there going to be time? Pressure damage. I've never seen the word pressure before. That answers so many questions. What are you doing? No. Disable auto repair. Disable auto repair. Disable auto repair. You're running out of time, Nettie. Get that thing built. You are going to dig. No. Why can't you fill this in? You can reach it. You're going to move to here. Because you're going to cancel. Oh, come on. Come on now. All right, another possibility. Let's dig these two out. Let's prioritize. Actually, I do it this way. You're a nine. You're a nine. Then you'll be able to walk up to there. Let's see if we can do that in time. Ikus, you are going to move to here. Is there any way that you can get to that one? Waiting for materials. Well, I wish I could... I wish... You know, Rimworld. I can say, Nettie, build that. Right-click. Build it. Instead, I've, all I can do is just kind of get them in the right area. Now, if we can take you two out in time. Get in there. Filling it in. Right now we're suffocating. And you're going to... Ah, there we go. That's your fastest way out. You you thought through it, and you're out of here. Whew. <laughs> now, find some oxygen. There you go. Oh, what a mess. Oh, what a mess. All right, well, there's our, our backup escape route. Yes. All right, now you are delivering slime. Okay, so with that, these are abandoned. Now we're going to try this again. Where are we? 45 minutes? I want to get this done. All right, one more try. Then we'll call this episode finished. And we won't get to half the other things I wanted to do. All right, you, that is all level 9 obsidian. And we're going to seal that in with two layers of 800 pressure behind it. These are going to be destroyed, even though that's getting damaged too when it's too away from that. Oh, this is frustrating. Okay. Nettie survived. If she isn't stressed out like crazy, I'd, I'd be surprised. Yeah, 31. She needs to go take the rest of the day off. 
Okay, guys. There are no other nines unless there's a harvest going on. That's the problem. Food's looking decent. Well, it's basically done. So everybody else is going to run into here probably at the end of the next day. Let's kick the speed up and run, race through the night. Anything else going on in here? No, no other dire emergencies. We're, we're having fun on our massage tables while our hatch is running back and forth. Yeah, and it's nighttime. Everyone's heading into there. Nobody's trapped. Good. This is breaking, but it's breaking a lot slower than the other one did. I'm waiting to see if this water is going to move into this space right here before we can get to this. That I'm curious about. Now, first of the day, they're going to want to go through and fill up this guy. And probably this guy. And do a couple of maintenance things. Got to top off the batteries, that sort of stuff. But I'll tell you what. For the sake of what we're doing right now, let's give up on power for just a while. There. The other two are already eights. Um, well, that's, that's pretty big right there. So move to... No, try that again. It goes to square be below where I'm pointing. My point here is it's below me. So you're going to go there, and you are going to go there. All right, you're off the wheel. You're going to recalculate and do what? Boom. Speed three. No, 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 no. Delivering. Delivering what? Tell me it's obsidian. You're going to hear why. You're really, you're delivering to here. What's the priorities in this area? None. You're going to the obsidian. That's where you're going. Okay, you already have obsidian. Alright, let's fill this in. And... We know they can get out of here. I don't need to build that to do it. Yes, there's no more getting trapped in here. We know we can get up on that, go across, get up. Yeah, we're fine. <clears throat> now, there's a lot of obsidian to pick up over here. Really? You're going to get some water. Well, we are dropping the pressure. <laughs> but we're erupting, so we're just setting pressure like crazy into this place. Just heard the, the, the printing pod go off, but we're going to ignore that this episode. All right, so here come two more. We've got Jafar and Ikus heading down, getting their soggy feet, and we're building. What I worry about is if we're going to pull this... It's granite. And sandstone, okay. So we're not going to get obsidian out of here. Good. I want to make sure that I'm going to dive over to the side, grab supplies, and then get trapped over here. Built. That's what I like to see. Guys are all working as a team, and we're firing through all this, and nobody's drowning. All right, delivering more materials. We're going to go build some of it. There we go. No, we're picking up obsidian, and we're putting it in there. Great. No, don't, 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 don't. Get, get, don't. Oh. Jafar, don't build him in. Thomas Lob, that's not too smart. Yes, I appreciate you taking the pressure down. But let's stay on this side of of uh, boiling. What was that? You dropped the water because you need air. <laughs> All that water. It's on. Well, it's on this side now. Okay, well, that's, that's a good thing. Well, we got two built. These are still breaking, and it's not happening near as fast as what happened over there. Let's go ahead and take it to speed two. Though, I've got to be careful that we're not going to build anybody in. So far, they can still walk up diagonal. They can still walk down through there. Building it. Once that gets built, we can't get through. All right. Don't do anything dumb, guys. And we're picking up. And no, just build it. All right. Now. Uh, we can go regular tile now. Regular tile, obsidian, nine. Put it in, guys. Like so. And deconstruct you. Hopefully before we get any damage. Now, priorities. We have a day left. Uh, priorities, we are nines, right? It did work. Okay. We're going to break him and we're going to load these up and build it. 
if we can get this built before any damage hits here, we already have water that's moved in one more square. Oh, it builds so much faster. I didn't realize that the insulated tile took so long. We've got damage going on here, but we're not going to be able to repair it. Now, Ebony, you do not dive into there. Ah, you did the repair. Thank you. If there was just some way to repair that one first. Dare I try. We took you to an eight. Will someone come through and repair that? Andy? No. Someone else? No. Got built first. And what are you? Did I put the wrong... No. Ah. It was just a different color because of that. So we're going to lose that one. Darn. But let's quickly build more. So Obsidian. Nine. Hopefully Obsidian is stronger than Granite. I'm just running on that assumption. I'm going to go four wide here, just in case I'm wrong. But, uh, yeah, let's just see it happen. That's about to go. Let's... Nine. Sandstone. Another set of ladders down there. We're going to go four layers here. And we'll even... Obsidian, nine, throw that across the top. All right, so far so good. One more in there. I think we've got this under control. I'm gonna pause here, I'll, I'll finish that off camera. Doesn't look as pretty as I would have liked, but that's what we've got. What I wanted to show you up here is I was going to punch through, put uh, punch this out, put in a another Weezwort and flower vase. Rather than attempting to take this, la this level up a little bit, risk this busting through, I'm just gonna take it down one space and do that. And even this, I'm, I'm really worried about this. We may abandon a bedroom over here or just change our design a little bit. Hmm. Maybe this, do, this does go away and the hallway goes through here now. That just seems a lot smarter. Yeah. And was there anything else to get into this time? I think it's enough damage. We'll get into this next time. Yeah. So, I'm going to call this one done. This episode's already gone a lot longer than I had planned. But... Yeah, that was crazy. Okay, we'll call this one done. It's been Noble Rambler. Thanks, guys, for watching. I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.